Hello and welcome to At Home with Anita Rosner. Great Britain is not the only monarchy in the world. In fact, as of 2022, there are 43 sovereign states, and many of those sovereigns are queens. But of course, whenever anyone refers to the queen, there is only one woman who comes to mind, Her Royal Highness Queen Elizabeth II. And as you know, she has recently passed. So today is a tribute to her. I am going to attempt to make what is by all accounts her very favorite dessert. It is called a tea biscuit cake or sometimes referred to as a tiffin. This tea biscuit cake or tiffin has very few ingredients and on the face of it, it seems pretty easy to make, but I have my doubts. Anyway, there's only one way to find out. Let's get started. So here's our tiffin. It has been chilling for three hours. So now it needs to sit at room temperature for about 30 minutes so we can get it out of the uh, baking dish. And while that's happening, we are going to melt eight ounces of chocolate over the double boiler to spread over the top. Um, I think it's going to be very lumpy looking, but we'll find out. So. Let's, uh, let's melt the chocolate. Now, before you attempt to take it out, you're going to run a knife around the outside. Now, I've seen this made in a round cake pan or a round mold. Um, all my cake pans are kind of big, so I was afraid it would be too short. So I did it in this instead. Let's hope it wasn't a mistake. Let's see if we can get this out of here. Yes. All right. Oh, it's actually much smoother on top than I had anticipated. Not bad. So this is not a ganache. This is just straight up melted dark chocolate. Um, on a business trip to London, many years ago, I actually got to see the Queen and Prince Philip in person. But I don't want to mislead you. I did not go out for fish and chips with them. They drove past me in a car. But it was a thrill nonetheless. Very thrilling. Do you think the secret to her longevity was eating all this dark chocolate. It's supposed to be very good for you. Full of antioxidants. I am shocked. This is a lot better looking than I thought it would be. Yeah. Now we'll let the chocolate set 
and then we'll plate it. I've plated the tiffin and now we're just going to give it a little garnish because it looks kind of plain. So I'm just going to put a dollop of whipped cream on the top and then splay a strawberry Shall we try it? Let's try it. Let's try a bit, shall we? I'm just gonna have a little tiny bit. So that's what it looks like inside. Layers of flaky tea biscuit. It's good. Mmm. That is sweet, so a little bite will do you with a spot of tea. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and become a subscriber. Leave a comment for me. I love to hear from you. Join me again next time here at home with Anita Rosner. Thanks for watching.